everyone! Husky Ninja here with the final part of my Story Seasons A Wonderful Life Let's Play. Now it has been a while! And for those of you who haven't seen on my channel, things have been changing with my new logo and banner. And as you can tell by the video gameplay footage, I have been using OBS. I'm still new to using it, but it's so much easier to use in Movie Maker or Screen Recorder. There is still a tiny bit of lag with Story Seasons, but nothing too bad. You guys can be rest assured that things are going to get better. Now, any clinking you're hearing is just me readjusting my microphone. As I haven't recorded anything for a while, that is because I have been to at HeroFest LARP, had a wonderful time there. So that's been new. I also got a blog I'm working on, or blog slash vlog type of thing, which is new to my channel. As I was at a Weish Wars shop challenge not too long ago. You're not bluffy enough yet to shear. But I thought, since you guys enjoy my story seasons let's play, that I would finish it all. As the main plan really for this was just to do like the first year of the game. And it is coming to that point where whoever your bachelor or bachelorette is, they come to your farm. Well, you go and get proposed, basically. Oh no, and C grade. I can't even sell C grade. Now, do I? I do have a chicken. Okay. It's been that long, I forgot how, like, quick the camera can move. But yeah, things have been going quite well lately. And if you guys haven't already, please check out my most recent videos. I have quite a few of them now. All mostly to be in Weish Wars, and I have started doing live streams on my Twitch as well, which I'm basically doing I feel up to stream as I'm so new to live streaming. So yeah, that's a lot of things I've been going on, as well as photography's been going well. And lots of other things too. I also have lots of videos planned for you guys. As I mentioned in my What's Been Happening video. Now I have been trying to record this bit for a, well, the final for this video, the Let's Play series for a while, but Movie Maker just did not want to work or behave it, well not Movie Maker, but you, you, the Windows Xbox screen recorder that is on all Windows PCs. So that's been interesting to deal with. And I have recently
recently got myself a new Switch game, that being The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Mostly because I play Skyrim that many times now is not really much of a challenge anymore. And I wanted something a bit more challenging, a way you never know what's going to happen, as it varies as to what choices you make does actually affect your gameplay. So I got that and I'm thoroughly enjoying that. I might eventually look into a video capture card. If I once I've done some research properly on it. So then because I also want it so I can record things like GameCube game well the last games of GameCube games N64, Wii, Wii U and of course Switch games. So I can share with you guys all of that through live streams out then archive and then upload here for you guys to enjoy. So yeah, things are going well. And it's an eye for you. I forgot how thumpy the footsteps are of the player character on this. It's like, how heavy footed? Okay, I'm just gonna double check if I can sell sea grade milk or not. No, I can't. So, sea grade, I think I'll just have to give out to people. So we're going to sleep as each month is only 10 days long, which I actually prefer compared to a lot of Harvest Moon slash Story Season games where it's like 30 days. The only Story Season game I did not like playing after a while was Story Season's Tales of Olive Town. Don't get me wrong. It's, it was a nice change, but it was lacking so much. Even after all the updates, it's still missing a lot of like charm and everything. I'm not trying to compare it to Story of Seasons, Tree of Tranquility, or Animal Parade, or anything like that. But when you compare it to like the proper Harvest Moon games before they were the real Harvest Moon games were called Story of Seasons, you can tell the love for the series really hasn't been there lately. There is hope for the one they're currently working on, which they say will have multiplayer capabilities via online. So that comes out and reviews for it are good and it's not too expensive and my computer can run it, I'll then get it. And I do apologize for the weird obnoxious sound you're hearing in the background, or might be hearing, as where I live, here in the UK, we get annoying vans drive around saying any old iron. And it's like a broken speaker and it's annoying as anything. You still give me sea grape milk. Okay. I'm gonna change that. I am going to feed you some fodder plus. to do the trick and also check inside the barn see what their food containers are looking like and they are good 
So I'll just call them all in so that hopefully we won't carry on getting sea grade milk. As sea grade milk is a pain to get rid of unless you have Van visiting. Then you can just sell him the milk you can't sell. So yeah, a lot of things have been changing, a lot of things are on the up and up, I am still doing cosplay, I just take it a tiny little break from it, most, for me being in cosplay, mostly due to, mostly being in a lot of pain lately, due to a medical condition, but hopefully that we turn around for the better. Pretty soon. And I've also been getting things ready for Japan Day in October. So you guys can look forward to that. As I will do some video work while I'm there. For a full video. As I, it's a convention I've never been to. But. And then. Me, me and Gutsy were both going to be running the cosplay zone there. So if you see us there, come by and say hi. It is a single day convention. And the cosplay competition is basically open category where it doesn't matter if your cosplay is bought or or homemade. It's just to show how much you love and enjoy the characters or series you're cosplaying from. And also, if you see us, come say hi. Let's see what he has for sale. Okay, I've used the hoe, the sickle, and the one can of to get to the copper stage. So I'm gonna buy a copper watering can. It just makes it easier instead of doing each square for the crops one by one. It also saves on some stamina. No, I'm good. Can't think I'd give Nina her flower. Oh. Oh. What? Oh, he hates plants. I forgot. Okay, I'm gonna see if he wants the egg. Oh. Okay, he doesn't want anything I have to offer. Mm -hmm. I still love Molly, or as she was called in the original, Muffy. I just not that keen on our new walk. I preferred her old walk 
Where she walked the same as everyone else. But, biggest coffee choosers, as they say. Now, if I remember correctly, I, we are going to be marrying Silica, or Cecilia. So I'm going to sleep through, or well, do the bare minimum day 9, like I did on day 7. And then, we'll see where we go from there. Of the water. Okay, don't need to water anything. Okay, that's good. Now, the same day I am recording this video, I'm also going to be recording a live stream of some more Honkai Star Rail for you guys. So, you guys can look forward to that. And I am going to remember this time to archive it and upload it here because <laughs> I forgot to last time okay you need fodder It'd be nice if you didn't step in the food And just throw that in. Dang it, I forgot to milk the cow. Still give me C grade after I gave you good stuff. Sleep again. But now I know as soon as it's spring, chop up plants. Top of the bird seed. Why is it so rainy? Okay, cuts I'm out of water. Come on, move! There we go. And then news. Now I have a question if the audio is echoey.
I'm still new to doing all the setup on OBS, so you just have to bear with me. So sorry, audio is not going to be top notch or the best. I have been following some YouTube tutorials in the hope of being able to fix that. Good morning, Husky. You better take good care of Cece, you hear? That gal's a like a daughter to me. Oh, Vesta. Yup, everyone in Forgotten Valley is chomping at the bit for the two of you to swing on by. Better hustle and tell them you're married now. Okay, why do they have to make Vesta's dialogue so hard sometimes to read out loud? <laughs> Isn't they try to make Vesta in both of the English text sound to you know better terms? A typical Texan accent that you hear in animation. If you don't choose Nami, which is the bachelorette with red hair, she does leave Forgotten Valley for a little bit, and then she'll come back later. Which just shows that how much she missed Forgotten Valley. This is the last time we'll see e her after this she passed away and he has to live on his own in a tiny little shack that looks more like a garden shed and he'll be replaced with the doctor who has like the cyborg eye And then you have like the group of what they're one of the characters from really basically called them like the outcasts of the valley. Cause it's all like artists and creative characters.
And I'm just going to keep that the same way it's been all the way through this last play. And then you have the fast forward to them having kids and all that. Or a child and all that. I do like how they have basically Celia in moccasin shoes. Which is really cute. Because they got a little flower on them. I think I'll just go with I'll be having a girl because I actually want to do a poll again and then wait and keep you guys in. That's I think it'll be a nice surprise. Let's see like what Cecilia wants. I hate how with this cutscene the text speech is so slow compared to the rest. Even if you have your text speech speed on fast, it's still so slow for that cutscene. Even here, and I think it's just like one downside about the game. I 
here you'll see that your house has been expanded to include a kitchen which also includes a separate toilet and shower which is really nice so you can put like things you need for, for quests or for recipes in the fridge which I think is just really cool to have Those are little four leaf clovers on the knee pads. Well, for the knee pads on the little one's outfit. And cute little versions of Cecilia shoes. It's just the little details from the outfits that are there, and they add them. Hmm. What to name the little one? I'll just go with Yippee. After this part there aren't going to be any more story season let's plays as a focus on this channel I will occasionally do a live stream of it if I feel like it and then go from there also if you notice your bed in here that changes when you marry Cecilia so it's really nice with a nice embroidered flower on it <laughs> And if I remember correctly, she's not the one you really noticed that with. Why is specifically a mole crickets? Why not just good night, don't let the bad bugs bite? But no, it's good night, don't let the mole crickets bite. I don't want to change the look, I just want to look in the mirror. Okay, so that is the end of the Story Seasons Let's Play. Thank you all so much for joining me, and I hope you've enjoyed the series from start to end, and I hope you all have a wonderful day, and if you're not, I hope things get better, and please